so welcome back to the next uh, tutorial uh, today I'm going to show how to how can you prepare the Gibbs diagram from the existing uh, graph here so now uh, first install your origin pro here and now you can see this interface so go to the tools here and you can see here digitizer okay so here in the file section click on that and import your image of the gifs so i have already here uh, the gifs uh, image here and click okay you can uh, manage your graph in the bigger section here you can drag this okay you have to uh, change these lines and overlap on your axis level so move it in here and again for other those line as well so in this way after overlapping these lines here you have to change this axis value here for the x1 here okay change it in the zero here and in the x2 here make it and here now for uh it's okay to be the one here over 60 50 70 so okay i will make it 60 and always remember this is good uh type no, for in the y1 value i'll change it with the 60 66,000 okay here in the scale type remember this in the scale type is in the linear type but here you have to change it in the log type now uh, to digitize this map here you'll see this manually pick point click on that now uh, drag this manual pick point to get the points here you can see this in the magnifier in these sections so now i will start with this line digitize it properly so for uh, to get the point double click it now after double uh, clicking it you can see the red uh, points here so so after finishing this digitization uh, here click uh, done okay so here in this uh, section you will see here go to the data click on that now you will get the digitized data here so this is your digitized data here i have made the, up to the point 104 okay now select these all from the one uh, to your total points here right click here and the copy this okay now uh, here you will have the book one section if you don't uh, have the book one as well just paste it you can uh, make the new workbook by clicking on this section so after pasting this data here 
now I will select all this data from the above now in the down section you will see the line so to make the line graph click here so you will get this data by uh, like this now you have to make a proper uh, graph from this okay and now change the scale here uh, double click here in the sections and go to the scales here so for the horizontal x axis uh, 0 and 1 and this is in the linear type the sections put here 1 and you can put whatever 6 okay remember this one also uh, I have already used the uh, lock in so here also you have to put in the lock okay you can do it you can also change the line and the ticks here uh, click on that for the bottom sections uh, put the thickness of the two here for the major ticks uh, it is in the out okay and for the minor ticks you can remove that one and for the top as well so click on the show line and the ticks make the thickness of the two uh, we don't need any major tick and the minor tick so uh, make sure you have make these on the knot okay for the left side as well uh, you can make it up to the two here yeah for the major ticks it's okay and for uh, this minor tick no and for the right section Click on this so line, make two here, one, and now. now you can apply this one here and click OK. So delete this section here, this one, and you can also put here in the TDS here. Have to prepare the gifts uh, like this in, in this version. So here you will plot the TDS and here uh, sodium and the potassiums with the calcium section. So uh, you can write it. This one is in the square format uh, so uh, to change this one in the whole uh, in rectangle shape uh, uh, you can click in this white section double click here and not in the layer but you go to here graph here and change the width and the height okay, I'll put here 8 and here in the 11 you can apply it and okay okay now you will see with these sections here you can bold these scales also with you can make of the 22 here and these you can you can also make different format okay i will go with the dash line here and the dash and go with the two okay you can change uh, to the different color as well here in the fill sections whatever you like over here you can make like this as well or you can make like this as well but i'll put here in the black now here you can see in the sections you can see the text okay so
so for in the gifts diagram here now in the middle sections there is the ring similarly for this you can grab here is the put uh, here arrow as well if you would love to put here you can change this color and the width as well Similarly, here in also, okay. This is the final graph which you will work with it. And